Never wait for hot water again with a tankless water heater from Plumbing Experts. Tankless water heaters are easy, convenient, and now more affordable with a no interest financing for up to 18 months. Stop with the cold showers and wasted water and call Plumbing Experts today. It's the Weather Extreme video. This is the morning edition for Thursday, the 14th of November. I'm James Spann. Little light rain possible, mainly from Birmingham South later today and tonight. Otherwise, things are quiet through the weekend. Upper look, the trough that brought that very cold air at midweek is rotating on to the east through eastern Canada. We have a zonal flow here and a wave that's over Mexico. And that'll be advancing rapidly eastward, producing a little light rain for parts of the state later today and tonight. Not as cold this morning. Most spots are above freezing now with clouds increasing. Gadsden 31, but Tuscaloosa sitting at 40. Very quiet today across the country. The only issue with the watch warning map, some fog over Montana. Could be some thunder later today and tonight over the Florida Peninsula. No severe weather. And otherwise, no severe storms expected across the country for a while. Amazingly quiet for November down here. This is the precipitation for the next seven days, the heaviest up in the far northwest corner of the country. In Alabama, uh, the guys at WPC basically suggesting nothing from Birmingham north and west. Light rain south and east of Birmingham with that wave coming in here later today and tonight. So let's look at modeling. Here's the GFS. This is the 06C run, 3 o'clock this afternoon. That trough over Mexico coming into the western gulf. And the day should be mostly cloudy. We might hit 50. Highs probably between 47 and 50 for most locations. And let's go to the high-res NAM at 6 o'clock. And at that point, some scattered light rain is possible. Rem remember, this is a very dry air mass. The, the moisture return is going to be very limited here. This is midnight tonight. Again, the bulk of the light rain would be along and south of Interstate 20. And even there, not much with this limited moisture. And then by tomorrow at noon, there could be a few patches of light rain on the eastern side of the state, around Alex City, Auburn, Opelika, but for most of the state, dry and with a clearing sky by mid to late afternoon. Here's the synoptic scale look. A deep surface low begins to form off the South Atlantic coast tomorrow. But again, for us, maybe a lingering patch of light rain on the eastern side of the state, but that's about it. And the high tomorrow should be in the low 50s. Saturday, a beautiful day. We start the day around freezing. The high will be in the 50s. The sky will be sunny. And Sunday should be a sunny day. Again, morning lows in the 30s. The high will be in the upper 50s, maybe touching 60 in spots. Monday, we're still dry. High close to 60. Now, Tuesday, a pretty good wave comes through the southeastern states. And again, the problem is there's just not much moisture to work with. The GFS is suggesting this wave might squeeze out some scattered light rain on Tuesday, but the European looks fairly dry with that feature. So for now, we'll mention just a small chance of some light rain on Tuesday, but obviously no big deal. Wednesday, we're dry. Highs around 60, and this is a week from today. Got a trough over the southwest, a little shortwave ridge here, and that would be dry and pleasant with highs in the low 60s and a good supply of sunshine. Let's go out 10 days. This is Saturday, the 23rd of November. Uh, wave off to the west, but again, there's just not much moisture here. This is suggesting there might be some rain on Saturday, the 23rd, but uh, for now, if that happens, it doesn't look like it's going to be a big deal. Here's the rain off the European for Birmingham. Not much for this time of the year. Uh, between one and one and a half inches, that's the mean, that green line for the next 15 days. And very seasonal temperatures, maybe a little below average, but highs most days in the upper 50s and low 60s all the way through Thanksgiving. That's it for the Weather Extreme video this morning. We'll have notes in the blog. The next video here by 4 o'clock this afternoon. If you can, catch us this evening on ABC 3340 News at 4, 5, 6, and 10 o'clock. Thanks for watching. Have a great day and God bless. KS Heating and Air, the team ensuring your comfort.